category of four nice, oh wait, I mean not nice girls. Meet Harriet, the type of girl to gossip about even her closest allies. Olivia, sweet as sugar to people's faces, but uh, whenever she's around her closest friends, don't get on her bad side. Here is Paige, the shallow girl who thinks she's better than everyone. In reality, she's probably the nice of all of them. Just kidding. And then there's Eloise, the clueless one of the pack. Honestly, you'll see what I mean. Oh my god, this place looks so good on my Instagram story. Oh my god, Paige, you look so gross in that photo. I can't be seen with you. You want it? Daniel broke up with you. Damn, Daniel! You're just saying that because I look better than all of you. Yeah, what are you supposed to be anyway, Paige? The oversized black bear? I'm a cat! Bellin! And anyway, Eloise's costume is so much worse than mine. Apparently, dressing as someone is Bellin. You know, I think I have a pretty good Halloween costume. Two faces, you know? So she's two faces. <laughs> Paige and Eloise, right? Eloise! Did you write our names on the booking? Well, you didn't tell me it wasn't supposed to. Oh, whatever, it doesn't even matter that much. Welcome. I hope you enjoy the unique location. Where is Eloise? She has my lip gloss. Uh -huh. Is this your lip gloss? Oh, uh... I found it on the floor. Okay, thanks. You can go now. Oh! I can go with it. That guy! Hey guys! Hey guys! Welcome back, welcome to, back to Polivia! <laughs> so, um, we're here at... Hope Hotel, which at Hell on Planet Earth. As you guys requested, we'll give you a little room tour. Just to show um, you around. Yeah, you know, so let's, let's go. Um, actually, I kind of need my beauty sleep, you know? Oh, beauty sleep won't get you anywhere, hon. <laughs> I'm sorry, did you say something? Do you want to say that again? <laughs> Next time you won't like what happens. <laughs> hey, so, um, okay, so okay, here's our yeah, room, <laughs> and it's so pretty, isn't Paige, it? Paige. What? Turn the camera off, Paige. Oh my god. Wait, why can't they see us? I don't know, just shush. Oh my god. god. Guys, what the hell? If this is a prank, it's really not funny. Just wake up! We gotta go. Do you think we should go too? Um, no, just... <laughs> what the hell did he do? Hello, hello. Have you fun, me? Please! What are you going to do to us? <laughs> Feel 
feel so close to you right now It's a force field I wear my heart up on my sleeve Like a big deal Your love bars down on me Surround me like a waterfall So, what's your name and why are you in specialised learning today? My name is Charlie Rice and I have dyslexia. Um, how does dyslexia affect your day-to-day -day life? I just can't spell. Um, so what test are you doing today, Charlie? Um, I'm taking a spelling test. I'm a little bit nervous. So, Miss Clear, um, what is, test is Charlie doing today? Charlie's going to be doing the South Australian Spelling and Comprehension Test. And what level is that test at? Uh, this is testing at a grade three level. So how do you like your co-workers? They're really great. We have a really great team environment here. Except for Russell. How do you think Charlie's going to go in this spelling test? I think she's going to find it difficult, but I'm confident that we've done enough practice and training and, and that if she can focus, that she'll actually do really well. And I think she'll surprise herself. Yeah, I agree, Ms. Clear, on all of those statements. So what's your job in the department? So I'm actually a filing cabinet officer, but um, I'm actually working towards to be first aid, to be beside Ms. Clear. You know, she's so inspirational to me. Pikachu, today? The calculators yesterday, they were really nice. They're Game Boys. Uh oh. You know, there's two types of there's like good, like two types of ends, what? like both ways. You're no, you're kidding. I'm not joking. What? How are we meant to do that? How, I don't are, know. Know. how, how can you tell the difference? You don't. You just have to get. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Night. The night was dark. How do we do it? Do it? I don't don't know. Know. We should sound it out. Yes. Oh. I. Two. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. N. brain cell because you know there's not many of them left one day Charlie decided to go to the park I do not know what she drank but it killed everyone hi so I'm brain cell number three and I'm I think I'd probably say I'm the best smartest brain cell in here um, I don't get along with brain cell number three she really gets on my nerves it's brain cell number two she's <laughs> she's so jealous of me it's so obvious hi I'm brain cell number four nobody likes me here um, I think it's because I actually know how to spell. All my friends are gone and I'm stuck with the stupid ones. I told you the P was silent. You need the H. Why are you listening to me? I told you. No. I told you you need the H. Me. What? The H. The H. Stop. Like in the Don't push me. So, what's it like to be the head cells of the spelling and reading faculty? Fa faculty. Faculty. <laughs> so, I'm sorry to bring up such an emotional topic. But I was just wondering how you guys are coping with the recent loss at the park of your friends. <laughs> Stop <laughs> laughing. Why are you laughing? This isn't something to laugh about. No. 
Where do you dispose of the dead cells? We just put them in like a box. Yeah, we send it. To Why are you being so insensitive? They, they don't. They, go, they go in a box. Don't they're they? dead. They go in a box. But they go in a coffin. Not dies. A box. Sorry, everyone, for my ignorance again. Mm -hmm. Have you guys heard of the term dyslexia? That's the one with the V in it, right? Dyslexia. I think. Yeah. I don't know. Is that English? English? Is that like a Which, which word am I going to say next? Could, could you please stop talking? Quit, don't quit now. So, how did the test go, Charlie? I think I did really well. I like got lots of the words right, and um, I understood what the teacher was saying. Good job. Them. So rich. But I wish I could be like They look so, so, so wealthy. What can we do? Hang on. Ah, you think what I'm thinking? Wait, boys, boys, boys come up. Come on, I've got an idea. How? Well, firstly, you need to help us with these bloody benches. We've got our own problems down there. Wait, but secondly, secondly, boys, I've got a great idea. All right, hear me out, hear me out. We roll a house. We have lunch at Burger King. What? I thought. Bur 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 Guys, quick, quick, let's go off the plane. What's happening? What's happening? Alright, alright, I've got a plan. Me and Max, we go to the shortstop. You guys go there. Sounds good. Because obviously it's an easy topic. Hey, Max, what's going on? Hey, what are you wearing? We're sneaking into a house. Yeah, these are my sneakiest clothes. Man United. Yeah. You couldn't even pick Man City. Oh, get on with it. Oh, anyway, it's open. Perfect. Oh, the lights are on. Why the lights are on? You want to see the party? Who's ready? S505. S1. The lights are on and the door's open. Perfect. Nothing, there's nothing in there. If you find nothing anything. in this one either. What? Just a waste of time. Let's get out of here. No use, it's locked. Who is that? Ah, 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 ah. Please. Open the door. No. Ah, 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 ah. no. Please. Please get him, he's bigger. Please. Please open me, please. Please. Boys, boys! 
these what did you get? We got these fresh clothes matching with our boy. Oh. oh. <laughs> Wait, what is this? Is this a photo shoot or something? Jack coming? Hey Jack. Hey Jack. Jack, time to go to the beach. Come on. Get your bodies on. They're not very beach going clothes. Wake up. Hey uh. Jack Grab his arms. We'll get him out of bed. Go on. Hey Jack. <laughs> wakey, wakey. <laughs> Come on, wake up. What's this? Stop playing around. You didn't have that much to drink last night. Wait. Jack? 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 No. 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 He's gone. Jack? No. no. What happened? We need to find some help. <laughs> The one who's dead on the floor right now. Uh, I don't know him. Did you kill him? I just said I don't know him. You don't know? You could have just killed him like a stranger. I didn't. Just Monday night murder spree, I don't know. I didn't kill him. Where were you about half an hour ago? In my office. Really? Have you got anyone that can prove that? No. But there's video cameras all around that can show me entering and exiting my office. Okay. It's a dead end. Yeah. We'll find someone else. Yeah. Now, why did you kill him? Huh? I didn't kill him. What makes you think I killed him? He's your boyfriend. That's a. And why would I kill my boyfriend? An affair. I told you about that. Wild guess, but let's go. <laughs> okay, but that doesn't mean I killed Jack. Covering up the evidence, huh? There were like a bazillion other suspects. Let's go find another one then. Yeah. <laughs> so, did you kill this man? Um, of course not. <laughs> we're innocent. You shouldn't even be interviewing us. Don't you know who we are? No? <laughs> um, we're Annie and Laura. Okay. Actually, it's Olivia and Paige. Ah, yes. Now I know you. These people are clearly crazy. They're having an identity crisis. <laughs> yeah. You know what? Let's try someone else. <laughs> so you helped Jack's girlfriend cheat on him, huh? Um, I guess so. Uh, what, why am I here? Did you kill Jack so you can cover up your affair? Wouldn't you like to know? Yes, I would. That's why I'm asking. Have fun with that. <laughs> You know what? This is the dead end, cut it. <laughs> <laughs> so what's your name? Yeah, it's, it's mm. Georgia. Georgia, all right. Did you kill this man? Yeah. You, you killed him? Mm. Yes. Why? 
I'm Norman. I just came from a rave. I don't know anything. Have you been taking something? <laughs> My mom's antidepressant pills, yeah. Makes <laughs> Ross as crazy as the last two. Yeah. Uh, you're free to go. Can I offer you some rehab later? Sure. Hey, right, man, I'm getting out of here. So, who are you? Hello? Hello? Anyone in there? No, I know. Not at the stars. Not really. Yeah. 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 Don't my father. Whoa, yeah, just... sit back down there. And he says, Why are you so serious? Yeah, well, oh my god. <laughs> 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 Bang! Ooh! Ah! Oh, ah! My favorite oh, swing! Ah! Oh, no! Oh, oh. Bang! 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 Pow! Dead. Today is the village's 17th banana bread day. When my children sent me to this retirement village, I thought it would be hell. And it is, except for the wonderful banana bread days, they give me the most delicious, beautiful banana bread. And I, I swear, you, you'd think it would come from heaven. It's really quite incredible. Um, so this morning I woke up uh, and that was my first priority. It's banana bread day! I hate Ethel. She is the most arrogant, annoying piece of garbage I have ever met in my life. Denise is difficult. Um, probably one of the most difficult people at the retirement village by far. Um, ever since I've been here, she's had something against me. I'm not quite sure what it is, I'm not quite sure what I've done to her, but she clearly has something against me. Something that I'm doing is upsetting her. Banana bread, banana bread, banana bread. It's not that good. The banana bread, it's it's quite, it's really quite different. The, the butteriness that they put over the banana bread when moist and warm, it's really like no other banana bread I've ever had. Number 18, anyone have number 18? Number 21. Anyone with number 21? 34! Bingo! We Bingo! have winner, the lovely Denise. Um, I did lose Bingo this time round. I was on a five day winning streak, but I did lose it to Denise. Um, which is, it puts you in a bad place, but I figured I wouldn't let it get to me this time round because of Banana Bread Day. I won, Bingo. It was great. <gasps> Should have been more careful. Um, I did burn myself, but I'm trusting the process of today um, in hopes that I get my banana bread by the end of it. I saw Ethel walk into the pool with her hearing aid on. Didn't say anything. There's definitely been better days um, in the retirement village. <laughs> um, today has been quite awful, um, some would say, but I still had my hope for the delicious banana bread.
Four strangers, trapped in a house together, alone. All after one thing, to last the longest. Who will stay, and who will go? Rolling in three, two, you start already? One. This is House of Perfect Enemies. Wait, we have to do an intro? Hi, my name's Maya. I live in Western Australia, I'm 20 years old, and I have two dogs. I'm Imani and I'm here to make some friends. Oh, reality TV sucks. Hi, I'm Mads and I love causing drama. <laughs> oh, um, hi, I'm Natalia and I like watching go down. You can't swear at the public. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I'll try to remember that. already tell that she's gonna get on my nerves. I don't know about you guys, but if you wanna stand around all day. Oh yeah, sure. Let me introduce myself. I'm Imani. Well, I'm gonna go see my new room. Thank God she's gone. She was so annoying. I bet she's gonna leave though. No one like her's gonna win. They just met their worst nightmare. Yeah, I agreed with her because I wanna last the longest. And if that's the way you have to do it. But why can't we all just be friends? <laughs> friends? nice for them like make something nice for my new friends you know uh thanks it was interesting so the initial reactions weren't that great yeah it took hours to make it reminds me of my dog at least it reminded her of her dog that's a happy thought right who got run in the bike car? <laughs> Why did she say that? <laughs> my dog daddy here we go. It was a present from my grandpa. And then he died of cancer. <laughs> I can't be here. I think I overshared. Maybe you should go check on her. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That food was rank, like her face. <laughs> we 
you throw it away. I thought I'd show them a thing or two as a warning not to mess with me. We saw what she was up to. We weren't gonna let it slide. What a Everyone, just stop! <laughs> I'd like to formally apologize for swearing earlier. I've now just been informed- Wait. I- I was already informed. Um. Oh, sorry! I'm sick to death of Maya. So I decided to get my revenge. I thought I'd get together something nice for the girls. Ladies, some drinks oh, to make up, you know, from our little quarrel earlier. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, this one's for you now. <laughs> I was so happy that she finally made up with Maya. Like, we're all trying to be friends again. Oh, I heard there were drinks. I knew something was brewing. The tea was brewing. I fancy a toast. To hope. To hope. hope. I poured in her drink. Wait, hang on. Cut, cut, cut. She wasn't trying to be friends again. Are we not allowed? What, what's the fun in that? <laughs> she, she, you tried to poison me! I was up to here, no here, in frustration. I'm sick of the bullying, treating me unfair, not liking me, it is not okay! Well, I'm sick of you! Well, I'm sick of you! Why are you even here? Why are you even here? That was the best 
moment of my life. I mean, oh my gosh, all the gossip. Why are you in here? I'm just in it for the money. And to see some great tea. <sighs> Stop fighting! Why are you even here? I just wanted to make friends. This isn't a place for friends. Screw hope! This is over! I'm leaving! I'm leaving! I'm leaving first! No, I'm leaving first! How dare you! I'm leaving first! I left first. Before she did. So technically I won. Well, they were leaving. They were both leaving. They're my friends. I had to go after them. And Natalia was looking at me weirdly. Well, then I guess I'll leave too. Does that mean I won? Cool. Guess there's hope after all. Did you get my prize? Bye, <laughs> shoot!